pilot pass. And if he's a pilot, he needs a flying machine. This styrofoam cup will work perfectly. First, I'll cut out a base or a cockpit for this flying machine. All I need to do is grab my scissors and make one nice cut right down the middle like this. And then I cut around. And basically, all I want to do is make a smaller cut. Check it out. I've made myself a perfect little cockpit. But I think it needs something to help it fly. So let's start off with a tail. Now I have all this extra styrofoam cup, so I can cut my tail right out of this. Make a cut right there. And this would be a great tail shape. Cut around there like that. And then we have a little tab right here. And that way we can connect it to our cockpit. And to do that, all I need to do is take my pencil and poke a bunch of little holes just like this. With all these tiny holes poked really close to one another, I can make a slit. It's a lot easier than using your scissors. I just shove my pencil around back and forth so I make it big enough, and then I can just slide the tail in. So check it out. It's starting to look like a tail, but what if I fold it up a little bit like that? kind of makes it look more like it's flying through the air. So I got my cockpit and I've got my tail, but now I need wings. And again, you can go back to all this extra styrofoam cup, and the wings are super simple. Just make one little cup like this, and another one like this. I'm making my wings this shape, but you can make yours any shape you like. Now I have my wings, and I just put them onto my cockpit the same way that I put on the tail. Get back to my pencil, and make the poke. This wing can go right here. Now I have one wing on, let's just add the other. Yeah, I think it would make sense to put this wing right across from the other wing. Push it in. I think it's time for a little bit of decoration, and for that, I'll just use my black marker. And I'll put one racing screen right there. That way. Now, another racing stripe on the other way. I'll add some lines right on the back tail here, too. Now, if those don't make it go fast, it'll make it look like it goes fast. It's almost ready to fly, but first, I need to add the nose. Check this out. I found this little paper cup, and I thought that would work perfectly for the nose. But before I attach it, I want to have it decorated. Here's one that I did already. Now, all I need to do is tape it right to the coffin. Now that all the details are in place, this is perfect for my little critter. <laughs> you can just sit back, relax, and take a nice flight home. <laughs>